Okay, welcome back to another episode of Detroit Become Human. Last episode was damn long. We played like all three characters. And now, out of all three, only two survived. And I'm glad that it wasn't Connor that died. <laughs> Thank God, this time for once, he didn't die. And uh, I really hope Luther didn't die. But uh, we'll find out right now. I wonder how long we have to go. I don't even know how far we need to, so... This church? Oh no, now North is going to take over and go, Yeah, we're going to do this and do that. I don't like her. Marcus gave his life for our people. He showed us that we can choose our own destiny. But he is not here to guide us anymore. Yeah, because he was wrong. Now it is up to us <laughs> to finish what he started. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are in camps right now, being destroyed. The time has come for us to make a choice. One that may decide the future of our people. They wanted a war, they'll get it. No, oh, you son of a stupid, stupid. We are going stupid. to fight for our freedom, and we will win, or we will die trying. Does she really think she can win against the whole entire world? <laughs> they really don't know what they're up against. North Korea could just go, BAM! They're all dead. Yeah, that was quick. What an idiot. I wonder if the others would have been just Josh, like Josh leading, or what's the other guy's name? Simon leading. Maybe they would have lead, led the A thing. Yeah, right, let's continue. That was pretty short. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. She the president? Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate They're like with the Germany. <laughs> and rest assured that everything did in our country Did they not know what happened nearly a hundred years ago? the security of our nation. They clearly forgot. Please? Please? Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant leader has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Please? Please? A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Please. Why is that damn? Why right, is that please? damn question? Madam President. Madam President, public opinion seems to be particularly hostile to the Deviants because of their violent behavior. Can you give us your perspective on that? The Deviants have proved to be very violent so far. They have demonstrated that they are a menace to society, and I have every intention of eliminating them. Please! Please. Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids Probably. working on sensitive <laughs> sites have been neutralized. She's literally Hillary Clinton's daughter. systems have been suspended like, to look. avoid any risks of Look at hacking. that. Literally. The situation is under control. Thank you. That will be all. Ah, oh, could have asked better questions. <laughs> I didn't realize there were more questions, but until like before. 
The last bus leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. Okay. Are you all right? Oh, but Luther. How the hell can androids get fevers? Literally, I just learned that she was an android the other episode, so it's just like... Yeah, I'm just gonna activate it. Wait, we could have done that the whole time? <laughs> Dumbass! We didn't need to be in the motel. <laughs> Are we back to the uh, town? This is snowing. It's literally the Holocaust. <laughs> but androids. Just in case. No. Nah. It's, it's my self defense mechanism here. I mean, no one else is using it. No, please don't hurt me. You're gonna burn your knees. Oh, you did. What are we gonna do? We have to keep going if we want to catch that bus. Stay close to me. We're going to sneak past them without being noticed. Not this again. I'm going to make it, Alice. I promise you. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Don't kill me. I didn't do anything. Shut up, I said. Are there many more? Lucky them. They're like rats. Or you look the boy, you die. Oh, we don't have to spend the night here. I'm freezing my nuts off. It's going to take weeks to clean up this fucking city. Believe me, we are far from finished. There are soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. Come on, get moving. Hurry up, get in. Hmm. I like this car. Luther, no! We can't help him, Alice. No! I'm helping him. Exactly. See, Alice knows what she's talking about. <laughs> I'm saving him. Okay, let's go. All day, every day. See? Now we would benefit the relationship and hey, save Luther. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. You just cut my hand for blood. <laughs> no, no, please. Oh, we're meant to be moving. I didn't realize. <laughs> I was just watching. It. Who are you? No, before they see you. Alice. Luther. Shh. I thought you were dead. Never. I was afraid I'd never see you again. I wanted to meet you at the terminal, but they caught me along the way. Come on. We're close, but we don't have much time. How can he not see us? 
Please look the other way. Go, go, go. Because I can't hear him. <laughs> Look the other way, please. Thank you. Please, please. Oh, I was going to take my chances just like right there. <laughs> Should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time. We could miss the bus. Yeah, but it might be safer. Risky. Three minutes. But we only have nine minutes. <laughs> okay. If I die, whatever. We're a family. <laughs> They're gonna check. If... I don't like humans who carry guns. Well, I, I don't like anyone. Who... Just stay calm, all right, Luther? Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. You do realize there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? We're going to take a bus across the border. Put my daughter someplace safe until things calm down. He suspects something. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's sick. A bad flu. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. I like that guy. Hey, wait a minute. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. You dropped this. Thank you. You're welcome. Now that's a good man right there. I like him. He's way better than the policeman that came to uh Rose's us. <laughs> Oof. Oh, today, no. November 11th, 2038 is the day the android people rose up against See, Now she thinks she's all this just because Max died and now she's taking everything. We won't cease hostilities until our people are free and negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. There are millions of us and we will stop at nothing. Millions? <laughs> I prefer to control the camera. <laughs> In my honest opinion. Is this a sniper? Please tell me it is. <laughs> oh, it is. Yeah, yo. I'm excited. This might be another long episode, people. <laughs> this might be another one. that 
Yes. I'm, I'm gonna definitely shoot her. I don't like her. What's up, Hank? Oh, no. Shouldn't do this, Connor. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. But they're alive. I don't give a damn if they're alive. Deviants are a threat to humans, Hank. They're the reason this country's on the brink of civil war. They have to be stopped. We're in this mess because we refuse to listen to deviants. Humanity never learns from its mistakes, Connor. This time it could be different. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. Step away from the ledge. Oh, what? You gonna shoot me? <laughs> I hope we have a... After all we've been through... I respected you, Hank. I didn't want to go I through his we son. Friends. I'd pull the trigger uh, yeah, I was just starting to like you too. But then I realized you never change. You don't feel emotions, Connor. You fake them. You pretended to be my friend when you don't even know the meaning of the word. What are you gonna do, Hank? You gonna shoot me? Exactly. I thought android lives mattered to you. Get away from the fucking ledge. You know I'll shoot you if I have to. <laughs> I don't want to die. Oh, pack here. <laughs> that wasn't bad. Ah, oh, whatever. Chango. <laughs> oh. Oh. I did the wrong thing. Oh, I hate the flick thing. <laughs> oh, no. oh, I don't have to flick. Okay. I should be on board now. <sighs> that was really fast. No! I'm not gonna die! Uh, I'm gonna have to shoot him if I, he leaves me no choice. Yes! Difference between you and me. Of course I'm gonna save him. You is not He's my partner. But you won't stop me from accomplishing it. You're gonna shoot me. <laughs> Thank God I actually reacted. That was not my fault. It's his fault. And I want to. I want to still shoot that asshole. <laughs> I have to. Uh. He gave me no choice, and I really liked him. <laughs> kind of has to live no matter what. I'm serious about this. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. The last bus for the border is full. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. We don't have tickets. They won't let us on. No. Nope. We're stuck here now. What are we going to do? Steal some tickets. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> yes. Oh, no, that's a magazine. <laughs> Another one. Oh, it's new. 
Okay. So this is why we get the old fashioned magazines, because they actually work. <laughs> No, we can't. We have to stay away from them. We really gotta do. Find tickets. He would have tickets. Sign tickets. Little girl. My little. You stole my little girl. Todd. Security. Over here. Let go of me or you will regret it. Okay. I didn't mean that. <laughs> you were going to kill her. All I did was protect her. When your wife walked out, she took your daughter away. You couldn't live without her. So you bought yourself an android. Substitute little girl. You thought you could love her. That she would make you forget. But nothing could replace your child. I just wanted to prove to myself that I was a good father. She was wrong. But I fucked it all up. I knew it would meet Todd again. She was right in the end. I didn't deserve them. I don't miss my little girl. You don't know how much I miss my little girl. Uh, is there a problem, sir? No. I made a mistake. Sorry. Please give me your tickets. <laughs> oh wait, yeah, I have one. Good luck. Okay. Didn't she eat spaghetti in one episode? But she's an android. Is that it? That was awkward as hell. Nothing happened. <laughs> Give me your tickets. Todd! I'm mad. He would have tickets. I can't walk up to them. I need tickets. Where do I get tickets? Find tickets. There's people over there. I can't let them see me. I can't even see me. I'm sorry, man. Woman. I think Oliver likes you. Alright. <laughs> A bit too young. Is she yours? <laughs> yes. She's adorable. That's it. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go then. Yes! That's what I thought! Well, we ain't dying yet. It should be Luther. 
It has I'm to be sorry. you. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I was Shit, scared. I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You kind of lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it and... Oh, never mind. Everybody for themselves, man. No. Sorry. What are we gonna do? <laughs> stay here. Everybody for themselves. I'm sorry. I'm find a safe place for all of her. If you didn't. I'm so sorry, honey. I don't know what happened. They were right here in my bag. Ah, oh, Luther's happy. Wow. I guess we can guess the bus now. See us. <laughs> See it, Dad. I hated you anyway. Yes, here they are. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> and your face. We're gonna get caught. See ya. We're on our way to Canada. Exactly. Next time you play The Walking Dead as a kid, <laughs> you know what to do. Come on, Alice loves us enough anyway. <laughs> Surely can she, she can take some negative. run. <laughs> I'm like, I ain't a part of this. Play dead. Like how I did. Did they really expect to win against the whole world? What You're idiots. You're a dumbass. You shouldn't have fought. You're no better than them. Give us a break. <sighs> it never ends. It feels like it's never gonna end this game. It feels like it's been ten years. This way, please. I don't know. Oh yeah, because if right. no temperature checks. We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Clara? Don't worry, Alice. We'll be fine. Text. Can't you just turn up? We can't get through, Kara. We both know that. I'll think of something. There's got to be a way out of this. We can't let them stop us. Let's go to the now bathroom and then us. think. <laughs> All that matters now is you and Alice. No! You matter, Luther. You, it's all up to you. No. 
Luther is Luther. He must live, no matter what. Jerry, you risked your life to save us, Carl. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Yep, yeah, I'm tagging Jerry. <laughs> Rose? Oh man. Rose. <laughs> I don't know you. <laughs> Told you, go to the bathroom and think it all out. So cute. What are you looking at? She crying. <laughs> okay. the Jericho read on TV I was terrified I thought you might have been killed oh, thank God you're all right you gave me your brother's address do you think that I of course he'd be delighted to have you we're going there too you'll be safe with him Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Cobra. Yes. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. I did all of that in the wrong order. Door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. And what about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the other side. That ass, though. His graphics are pretty damn good. Guess how that much. The faces. Oof. There's probably something we can do with our temperature. It took way too long. It's all up to Jerry. Hmm. Surely we can use the hand dryer and like warm ourselves. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> I'm very good. Alive. You deserve to be free. Don't say that, Adam. I just hope people will realize that one day. See, now I like you. <laughs> what big teeth you have. That gap. <laughs> Hey, no pushing in the line. <laughs> I'll be so pissed. Jerry, it's all up to you. 
What do I do? Make a decision. Sacrifice Jerry, man. <laughs> I don't give a damn about him. <laughs> It's all up to you, Jerry. It's all up to you. He's not gonna do it, is he? <laughs> ID? How did we get in front of him? We were way behind him. Is she all right? scared anymore, little girl. There are no androids on this side of the border. <laughs> Doesn't sound like Canada to me. Welcome to Canada. <laughs> you seem not to be trusted. We might not. We might not. <laughs> Hell yeah. I hope. <laughs> Please, Sam, that was it. Oh, man. That's a long episode. Connor, what are you up to? You're going it's down nice. south. <laughs> my mission is to neutralize the leader of the deviants. And I always accomplish my mission. You always have to say that, man. <laughs> we fought we lost. You can't hold my people down forever. One day we'll rise up again and we will win. Go on. Shoot. What are you waiting for? <laughs> Nothing. She just showed up. Damn! Oh! You dead. Thank God for that. Josh, you take over. Is that it? <laughs> and now, straight over to Detroit for a report on the conflict. Josh? Yes, Michael. Authorities have just confirmed. Fighting has now ceased in Detroit, and the area around the Hard Plaza camp is now under control. We can see soldiers going through the city at this very moment, and they are exterminating the last fleeing deviants. Law and order has finally been restored to the streets of Detroit. There is a general feeling of shock in Detroit after the terrible events of the last few hours. And initial estimates report several hundred troops have been killed. According to our sources, I don't like the deviant you. leader known as North was shot during the fighting. The death of the deviant leader marks the end of the android rebellion. The destruction of the androids in the camps can now continue as well. Oh, jeez. Nevertheless, it will take some time for Detroit to recover from these events by creating machines more intelligent than ourselves we took immense risks with the very future of our civilization however the situation is now under control the total destruction of all androids will soon be complete not connor the last remaining deviants will be hunted down and destroyed please have a connor and bless you and God bless the United States of America. It's over, Alice. We're free. We escaped Wonderland. <laughs> Okay. Uh, <laughs> I 
Canada. A place for everybody. Oof. Finally. That was a long game. <laughs> I don't know actually how long that was. I felt like quite a while. Great. See, we got a happy ending in the end. We all got a happy ending. We defeated the Deviants. Kinda survived. Carl survived. Alice and Luther survived. Everyone survived. Except the people I didn't like. I like Tank though. Tank was alright. But he gave me no choice. I wanted Connor to live. And I have to do what I have to do. So that's not my fault. <laughs> it, see, if it was between Hank and some other guy, I would have chosen Hank all day. And obviously, I shot North because I was like, "Shut up!" He just made literally everything worse. And rip Carl. <laughs> I wonder what happened to Carl. Did he get like a heart attack? Because I know what happens if you didn't choose to kill the son. That he dies of a heart attack. But what happens to him if he... Um... Kill his son. Does he die anyway? <laughs> I thought Todd would have joined us as well. Or the, um... What's her name? Alice. Would have joined Todd in the end. But I guess not. And I was so surprised when we saw him. And I was like... Kind of expected it to be honest. I was like, we're gonna see Todd again. But, you know, I wasn't really sure. <laughs> I want, I really hope Connor doesn't like, get destroyed or anything. He's my favorite character. And they're gonna destroy all, all, all androids. <laughs> this guy. It would be nice if we saw this guy. Again. <laughs> Give him some uh, karma. Look at the man. How dare you slap a little girl? It, I don't understand the point in buying an android kid. <laughs> She's never gonna grow up. I don't think they grow. But you know, them. You could. They'll probably invent androids that would probably eventually be able to like grow like humans. And maybe possibly like give rebirth and everything. Thank God he didn't sell us out. <laughs> Man. Ooh. Oh, not this again. <laughs> More therapy session. Connor. Connor, I'm you so say that every time. You. I'm not. <laughs> the deviant issue has finally been resolved. Now with these unfortunate events behind us, Cyberlife can return to business as usual. Of course, we will have to rebuild our customers' trust, but it's only a matter of time. I have a surprise for you. You're an android. This is the new RK900. Faster. Stronger. No. And equipped with the latest technologies. No. The State Department just ordered 200,000 units. No. What is going to happen to me? You've become obsolete. Yes. You'll be deactivated. You can go now. I knew it. I knew it. I didn't trust her ass. Ah, oh, you son of a, you son of a dog! Didn't she die, like ten years ago? I'm so confused. She must be an android. Two hundred thousand. They basically, they basically like Apple. 
literally releasing new phones every damn second. <laughs> They're just gonna replace them like it's nothing and just add a few touches, like changing eye color and changing his clothes. I don't want that. Uh, how can they just replace him like that? I basically just got screwed over. Like, I literally just got screwed over. <laughs> I basically trusted the right person for the wrong reasons. <laughs> or maybe the other way around, I don't know. <laughs> uh, I wonder what would have happened if Connor actually uh, joined Marcus. Hey, I think they would have won, no doubt. <sighs> but I literally just screwed myself over now. <laughs> what a dog. I really want to know her case, though. Is she an actual android? Because it says in the description, she died. <laughs> or maybe that's what they said, and they just faked her death. But, uh... Who knows? I wonder if there'll be a sequel. Oh, they're making 200,000 on the new model. 200,000. I don't know how many models of Connor there is, but... 200,000 is a lot. these credits <laughs> uh, that takes so long to go wow hmm what else I am so that I'm actually glad Luther didn't die thank God I made literally everything good but we just got screwed in the end <laughs> I mean car and all that they didn't get screwed but Connor Oof. Oof. I just got the smack in the face for that. And I just, I just had to shoot North. I just, she just annoyed me. You know, I liked her at the start, well, when I first met her. But then she was like, yeah, yeah, complaining and all that. And trying to force me to do things. I'm just like, no, I make my own decisions. And I'm like. And now, look what she did. She basically created a war for nothing. <laughs> if she wasn't in charge, I wonder what would have happened. I wonder if there was an option if Simon or uh, Josh was in charge. Because they did have a different opinions. I think Josh just wanted um, to just stand their ground and just not do anything. And he goes on complaining that Mark is going, Oh, why did you attack? What do you think? We, they would have all died if I didn't attack. Like, is like, what, why wouldn't I attack? I obeyed the orders at first, and then they just turn up and change, the, change their decision and decide to shoot us. And I'm just like, no, I don't want none of that. It's not like I wanted to fight. But in the end, it doesn't matter anyway, because we got a sick as it. <laughs> fighting um, scene, which was pretty good actually. Although the only thing was my reaction times were really off compared to all the other episodes. <laughs> but uh, I guess that's all right. How long are these damn credits? <laughs> I wonder if there'll be a sequel. I really doubt it though. See, if I had a choice to either shoot the Amanda chick or North, I'd probably shoot Amanda. <laughs> right now, if I had the choice. And then North. <sighs> well. It's been a long episode. 
don't know, can we skip this? I guess we can't. Well, I don't think anything happens in the end. If it, if there is, I'll probably just add it. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and this entire walkthrough or playthrough of Detroit Become Human. There will be more to come, such as H1, other type of games. And uh, we'll see you guys on the next one. Goodbye.